And here, uh, Elizabeth Warren says that uh, shows that she also doesn't seem to know about the other part of being education secretary, which is the sort of the financial aspects of the job. Chairman is the only other party to the so-called precedent of we don't have a second round. I asked my staff to actually pull the record from the hearing we had with King, and you said uh, when you. I should say. Elizabeth Warren is starting off by uh, describe, uh, uh, basically saying before she gets into questioning, you know, why can't we have multiple questions here? This is absurd. And Lamar Alexander is saying, well, we didn't need any extra questions for the last three secretaries of education. But Elizabeth Warren makes the point of like, well, did anybody ask for extra questions? Maybe nobody wanted them. And you said uh, when you called on me, I think we have time for a second round. Senator Warren, you can be the first in the second round. Just turns out I was the only one who stayed and had questions. So I understood. That's why we had time. I understood that that precedent meant that anybody who had questions for a second round could stay and ask them. And while we're doing precedents, I also understand that the precedent was that President Obama's nominees that came before this committee had all filled out their ethics forms and that those were available before we had a hearing so that we would have a chance to ask questions about them in public. So I'm a little confused about what precedent means here. Uh, Ms. DeVos, many of my Democratic colleagues have pointed out your lack of experience in K-12 public schools. But I'd like to ask you about your qualifications for leading the nation on higher education. The Department of Education is in charge of making sure that the $150 billion that we invest in students each year gets into the right hands and that students have the support they need to be able to pay back their student loans. Pause it. The Secretary I wonder when Elizabeth Warren says the $150 billion that we spend on education each year, if Betsy DeVos doesn't say like, I have a couple of billion dollars. Okay, I just wonder if <laughs> what they need to be able to pay back their student loans. The Secretary of Education is essentially responsible for managing a trillion dollar student loan bank and distributing thirty billion dollars in Pell grants to students each year. The financial futures of an entire generation of young people depend on your department getting that right. Now Mrs. DeVos, do you have any direct experience in running a bank? Senator, I do not. Uh-huh. Do you have you ever managed or overseen a trillion dollar loan program? I have not. How about a billion dollar loan program? I have not. Okay. So no experience in managing a program like this. How about participating in one? I think it's important for the person who is in charge of our financial aid programs to understand what it's like for students and their families who are struggling to pay for college. Mrs. DeVos, have you ever taken out a student loan from the federal government to help pay for college? I have not. Uh, have any of your children had to borrow money in order to go to college? They have been fortunate not to. Uh-huh. Have you had any personal experience with the Pell Grant? Uh, not personal experience, but certainly friends and um, students with whom I've worked. So you have, have no personal experience with college financial aid or management of higher education. Mrs. Which is also um, consistent with her experience with uh, public education. She has never been involved with public education, uh, except for, I guess, in trying to make sure that there's no regulations for privately uh, owned and operated charters. Although, to be fair, for I, profit. Uh, to be fair, I do think that she has some, uh, at least, exposure to uh, fraudulent schemes on the consuming public. Yeah, I mean, just from the wrong end of that. Yeah. Hey, it's Sam Cedar. Why don't you uh, subscribe to this channel? You can do so right, uh, right over here. Over. Subscri subscribe.